Callum, my name's Callum Smart, I'm 13 years old and I'm from Swindon. Dan was a brilliant best friend. He was really cheeky, um, sort of boy that had lots of friends. Um, he was just a really nice, loving, caring, caring boy really. He was like the only one that understood me. So like, if I was upset, he'd always cheer me up. Him and Daniel were just so close, you know, inseparable really. So wherever you'd see one, you'd always sort of see the other one next to him. Daniel was out on a bike ride with his dad and his older brother. Daniel was sort of at the back of the, at the, back of the group, um, going up a road and uh, a road sweeper was coming the other way. I just got a phone call from uh, my older son Robbie just saying to me, don't panic, but there's been an accident. Um, I think Daniel's going to be okay. Um, but then his sort of dad came on the phone and sort of said, you know, obviously he's pretty shaken, but sort of said, you know, I don't think it is okay. You need to sort of, you know, you need to come. We got a phone call to say from his stepdad to say that he'd, he'd been in an accident. So I had the task of having to tell Callum that, which was, I'm sorry, which was the hardest thing I've ever had to do. Um, it was really hard. I was distraught really upset because obviously he's my best mate so so a virtual run is a run that can be ran walked hopped anywhere people can do it in their own time um, wherever they are location wise and I set up a page and within weeks we had over 1200 people join seeing all these people that didn't even know Dan um, made me so happy that they were out running for Dan in Dan's memory. He's raised an extraordinary £30,000 for Break and that money has been absolutely valuable to us in helping uh, raise awareness of road safety and uh, increasing uh, road safety not only in the UK but around the world. I'm going to raise more and more money in memory of Dan to keep on doing these races. Daniel was the sort of person that really liked helping, helping others anyway. So now that Callum has been able to do that, um, I think, yeah, he'd, he'd think that was pretty amazing.